makeup tutorial as in nakakamiss. So, nakita nyo naman sa intro. That is a makeup look that I wore recently that got a lot of compliments both on TikTok, IG, and a lot of you guys wanted me to recreate it. And so, your wish is my command. Of course, I will recreate it. By the way, I'm wearing a tube top, okay? Nakapag-prep na ako ng skin, so I wanna start off with the makeup. I'm super excited kasi nakatanggap ako ng PR. This is by the brand Baron Bliss. Actually, may pag-giveaway tayo sa video na to. I'm gonna have you visit the description box below to check the mechanics and everything. This is a Korean brand, so kakalandang niya here in the Philippines. And I saw this also through Hazel. Sinabi niya yung owner nito is makeup artist ng Red Velvet. So if you guys are K-pop fans and Red Velvet fans, you already know. Anyway, I want to show you guys some of their products. They have the Makes Comfort Lip Mats. Pinakita ko talaga yung packaging sa inyo. I'm gonna try out some of these shades for you guys. Lakitan talaga ako sa packaging kasi very ako eh. Like very cute cute pa girl girl. Meron pa silang mga sheet masks. Ayan, meron silang yogurt mask. This is the tree and this is the Sakura Brightening. Na-excite ako sa powders nila. This is the Soul Matte Loose Powder. Viral to sa TikTok, just so you know. So I'm I'm super excited to try this. They also have the Fine to Refine Compact Powder. Let me just get a ha for the packaging. I mean, look at that. That's the cutest packaging. It's like a graded flower. They also have some eyeshadows and blushes. They even have a micellar water for the face and eyes. This one, I'm super excited. Do they haven't done a makeup tutorial in a hot minute? So, but essential yung ang atin yung. Gonna use concealer first. This is their Start Over Concealer Seamless Matte. I'm in the color Cool Light Petal. Yes, sumisika talaga tong brand that was especially on TikTok. So, I'm just really curious to see kung ano yung products na meron sila. You know me, I love me and my Korean makeup, you guys, as in. Okay, this concealer is blending out really well and parang nag-disappear siya sa skin ko. Ganun siya ka-perfect match. I'm so happy. Ito yung shade na pinadala nila kasi I was actually so scared. I am blending the concealer right now. And I can say, look at that. It's blending out pretty seamlessly to the point that it doesn't even look like I have product on. I have tried a lot of concealers. At this point, yung ibang concealers, they're really super flawless and full coverage. You can see, like there's like a marking where the concealer ends. This one doesn't have like any markings. It's like, it's seamlessly fading onto my skin, which I like, especially for day-to-day -day looks. The coverage of this concealer, I have to say, is on the lighter side. Kung ang hanap is full coverage concealer. I'm not sure about that. I feel like I have to build up Pero yung maganda sa kanya, ang bilis niya talagang mag-blend. Tignan nyo guys. Isa to sa mga pinakamabilis mag-blend na concealers. Kung on-the-go person ka, magugustuhan nyo to. Ang dami ko ng mga concealers na try na, you know, needs a little bit more working in. Mas airy to sa skin. As in, ito yung undetectable concealer na kahit kamay, it will work even if you just use your fingers to blend it out. One of the easiest to work with na concealers na try ko ever. Coverage is light. Good thing it's buildable. If you guys are back to school, this is the perfect concealer kasi sobrang undetectable niya talaga. Hindi siya halatang naka-concealer ako. I'm gonna use a little bit of the skin tint. Ito yung light it up skin tint nila. This is the packaging. Comes in a glass bottle. Super cute. The shade they gave me is 02 Medium Blossom. And I just know it's gonna be a bit too dark. But I'm just gonna apply this on the center of my face. So, notch ko kasi to. And it just looked like a bit too dark. I'm not sure if you can see. But it is a bit too dark for me. Still, I really wanted to test it out kasi... So I'm applying a bit on the nose. It's got that same formula base with the concealer. Na parang undetectable siya. Mabilis nang iblend. Like I didn't even have to work that on. But you can see it's a bit dark. So I can't really apply this all over. A bit too dark for me. I'm so bummed because I don't have the right shade with me. Like you can see it's a bit dark. But we're gonna make it work. Baron Bliss actually did an amazing job with their base products in terms of formula. How lightweight they are. They feel like nothing. I feel like I have nothing on my skin. This is insane. Also, it's not tacky at all. Like, you know, it's like a powdery, like natural velvet finish. Brow time. I love the packaging of their brow pencil. So this is the Make Me Classy Eyebrow. Usually, I'm not the biggest fan of triangular brow pencils like this. I prefer the thinner ones, but we're still gonna try this out. Meron na siyang spoolie on the other side. Malaking bagay sa kanyang spoolie. I'm gonna let you guys know my actual first impressions. Creamy. Ang bilis niya lang i-line yung kilay ko. Wow, this is creamy. 
I don't know lang sa lasting power. Side note, ever since I got my brows microbladed, my life has changed so much. Imagine you, hindi ko na kailangan mag-effort masyado sa kilay ko. That's why I'm just using the littlest, tiniest bit of this eyebrow pencil. And yeah, no nagpa microblade talaga ako. Changed my life. Yeah, I just extended my eyebrows a little bit. Super creamy. It took me like maybe less than a minute to do my eyebrows. I set ko lang yung eyebrows ko. What I do is I coat it with an eyebrow gel back and forth. So I really make sure every strand of my brow is set and then I like to push it just like so. At dahil maarte ako, iko coat ko lang yung brows ko ng eyebrow mascara just to match my actual brow color to the color of my hair. If I were to leave my brows like this, medyo magumukha siyang super harsh and I really don't want that crazy harsh look. I really want to match it with my kind of caramelly hair color. This brow mascara, I initially bought it because I had red hair. Now that I have caramel hair, it still works perfect. But, yeah, I have to say, ang bilis mag-fade ng red hair. Mga one week lang, guys, kapag every, especially everyday, pag everyday mo siya shampoo, girl, one week lang, wala na yung red hair so it's a such a high maintenance color i enjoyed having it but truly was high maintenance now this is how my eyebrows look they're laminated they're gonna stay this way for a really long time and they match my hair which is perfect time to try out these powders on my left or on your right is the find your fine compact powder spf 25 PA++. So I'm thinking this would be amazing to bring with you guys for retouch purposes, di ba? Some of the claims of this powder may have up to 24 hours oil control. It's also supposed to be waterproof and sweatproof. And it is ultra light soft powder. Meron na siyang mirror, which is always a must for compact powders. I love that. As for the scent, meron siyang slight floral scent. Nothing too crazy over the top. Also comes with a puff. The puff seems to be a really good quality puff. As you guys can see, yung finish ng skin tint and ng concealer, I would say satin, hindi siya dewy. Again, I'm using the fine to refine on the left side of my face. That feels really creamy and also has a little bit of a brightening effect because that shade, I feel like, is my perfect. This shade also is my perfect match. Wow, that's blurring my pores. That is. Beautiful, and this powder isn't actually looking too dry. Like for a powder, for a compact powder, I expected it to look dry. But look at that. Nama matify yung face ko. It's not making my skin look dry. Like, whoa, that is pretty. That's really pretty. Ang lakas yung makasmooth, ang lakas yung makabigay ng filter. In all fairness. And I love the puff. The puff is super convenient for touch-up. As for the Soul Matte Loose Powder, ito yung viral sa TikTok. Weightless blooming Sakura scent powder with cool sensation for pores coverage and a shiny complexion. So, pwede siya sa pores, also for sebum control. Weightless cooling powder, waterproof and sweatproof. And this one I've tried once, pero hindi ko siya masyadong like winner test. Hindi ko siya masyadong talagang tinitigan eh. Like, na-curious lang ako sa kanya. So, I have tried this once, but I still don't have like a proper first impressions for it. So, let's just pretend the first time ko itong itatry ulit. This is how it looks like. We have enough product here. I'm just gonna do this. Tapping the excess powder, I don't want to look super powdery. Oh, okay. This side is the pressed powder. This side is the loose powder. I think I actually like the pressed powder a bit better. I feel like this one has a more brightening effect and it also has a lit, like a touch bit more coverage than this one. If you can see, this one just completely smoothed out and blurred my skin. This one did that too, but must be coverage. I'm not sure if you can see. It's just the tiniest bit of difference. Both of them, hindi talaga nag dry yung skin ko whatsoever. Wala nag emphasize ng aking mga imperfections. I look like I actually have a filter on. If you guys prefer a loose form, super lightweight, tapos mas walang coverage, yung talagang setting lang siya and just airbrushing everything. This one, the Soul Matte Loose Powder, is for you. If you guys want a little bit of brightening and a little bit more coverage, perfect for touch ups, this one. Go for the fine to refine compact powder but i feel like the formula in terms of smoothing honestly they both feel super smooth like wala masyadong difference depende lang sa coverage level na gusto mo and this one comes in a loose form so you can easily dust it off while this one is better for touch up so depends on your preference but you can see both sides look amazing i'm just gonna use this bronzer na natanggap ko as a gift dun sa pre-order kung because i pre-ordered like a bag and yeah a shop sent me this one, like as a gift. Since I have cheekbones, I'm going to extend the bronzer ko here. 
just to give me more of that like sculpted look. Just doing a little bit of nose contour also. Nothing crazy. Okay, I like that the products are still blending really nicely kahit na nag-powder na ako. May nagsabi pa sa akin, ang galing ko daw mag-fake ng ilong. I, 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 I agree. I agree, hon. I think ultimately, my nose shape is that type of nose shape na madadaya mo using contour. Yung parang contour lang, akala nila matangos na. Perfecting my nose. We're gonna use the blush. This is their Sparktacular Party Blush in the shade Ruby Red. This looks so good. Let's try to swatch it. Oh, the pigment. Holy smack. The pigment. Holy. Okay, I feel like I just need like, a bit of this. And oh my gosh. I feel like making super pigmented tong blush, na to, which I love. I mean, oh my. <laughs> yes, it is, honey. What? That is so pigmented, you guys. So pigmented and it's got a, it's giving me a glow too. Wow. Hun, hun, tea, wait lang. Shindi ako prepared. So we're gonna put this sa eyes ko. I'm just doing a little dusting of the same blush on my eyes. I'm digging it, to be honest. This blush is not for the faint of heart. Um, I, but this blush got me wanting to try out the other shades because you guys I think I was a blush I was applying a bit of this on the center of my nose With the remaining product on my brush, I'm just gonna apply this on my chin Also applying the same blush on my lower lash line just for consistency I'm gonna dip into the Fortune Cookie Eyeshadow in number 3, Success. I'm gonna dip into this really pretty like shimmer shade at the bottom. Apply this on the inner parts of my eye. Oh. <gasps> Ooh, girl, that is pretty. Since I have highlighter from them, I'm gonna try to use this as a highlight and see if it works. It works. It works. It's like the perfect pinky rose gold. Highlight. Wow. So cute. I'm with setting spray and I'm just going into this color. Naman. I'm gonna do like a liquid eyeliner thing because that's what I do. I'm just really scared of using liquid liners agad agad. I remember I just. Oh wow. Let's take a red. I just did like a super baby wing. Now that I have the shape that I want, the outline, this is just a baby wing. We're gonna do this one, the Better Than Magic Eyeliner. I'm just gonna coat that like red um, liner because that's not really necessarily the look I'm going for. I really want like a, like a solid black. This eyeliner is crazy black. Whoa. Whoa. And it's also super thin. I'm shocked. So I'm just gonna crumb my lashes real quick and I'll be right back. Mascara is done. The look is almost complete. Time for falsies. These ones I got from Shopee lang. Super inexpensive and they give me that like anime look. Okay guys. Hindi ako expert maglagay ng falsies na sabi ko sa inyo. Shit, kinakabahan ako! Please work, please work. Because this one looked incredible when I used it the other time. This is my second time using these falsies. So, I'm still kinakapakapa ko pa kasi hindi talaga ako magaling mag-apply ng eyelashes. And then I press them with my natural lashes. And there you go. Okay guys, hindi ako napahiya sa inyo na-apply ko. So, medyo teary-eyed lang yung red ko for some reason. But I'm still so happy I did this. The trick I like to do is I curl them both. After ko nang ma-apply, I really like curling my false lashes to my real ones. Just to blend them in better. And you see, your anime effect niya mas nung pop. Sometimes you can see like the fold of your eye, just tight line. Tight lining makes a huge difference. You will see this just looks more seamless. Tight lining is key. To complete the look, I'm just gonna add a little bit of highlighter, of course, on the tops of my cheeks. Just adds life back to the face. See what I'm talking about? I feel like my blush now is like gone. Parang kinain siya ng mukha ko. So, I just need a bit more. I swear, like my face eats blush. Kani na kala natin parang 
ay sobrang intense yung blush, but my face, it eats blush, hun. Lining my lips just really quickly. Now for my favorite part, this one. You need this in your life. I'm gonna use a Baron Bliss Mix Comfort Lip Matte. So, marami siyang shades. Actually, they sent me five colors. We have 01 Berry Set, super pigmented. I feel like Velvet Cloud is super nipis sa labi. It's unlike any other lippy I've tried. It's not like the usual Korean brands na mas silicone. This one has a little bit of silicone, but it's still smooth and thin on the lips. The formula has surprised me because it's just super unique. This one is Brown Avenue. Pink Soul. <gasps> Super cute. This one is Peach Around. Ah, so cute. So nice. Pigmented siya, guys. My favorite shade is Charter Nude, which is the one I'm gonna use today. I'm gonna swatch it here. Tada! My lips are looking pretty dry and pretty purplish, actually. We're gonna apply Charter Nude just to... Make it look nice. Gabi, ang ganda ng formula nito. Oh my gosh. Smells really good. And one of the best formulas I've tried in a while. It's so unique. It's so comfortable. And look at that color. Ang ganda ng shade na to. This is Charter Nude, guys. If you had to get one shade, get Charter Nude right now. If you guys don't like your liquid lipsticks, you are gonna love this one because it doesn't even feel like it's a liquid lipstick. But it also doesn't feel too silicone-y. It's like the perfect balance. I can't believe a liquid lipstick is like this. I'm adding this pink shade. Just to give my lips a little bit more life and dimension. This combo in Chartered Nude and Pink Soul looks amazing. I'm obsessed. Probably my favorite product in the whole line. Out of everything I tried, actually really impressed with most of them. Um, super nagusang ko yung concealer. If you are looking for just something to wear on a daily basis that is so easy to blend, glides on like a dream, doesn't look cakey, perfect medium coverage for daily wear. I think you're gonna enjoy this concealer. Let's not forget about these powders that just blurred out my skin. Like, I'm not even kidding. Super blurring yeah. You can't even see my pores. I love these powders. I think any would work for you. Both are really, really good. I think I prefer this just a tiny bit. I'm in love with these. These lippies that don't even feel like I'm wearing liquid lipstick. Such a wonderfully unique formula that you have to try at least one or two shades. Maniwala kayo saan. Look at this. Look at this juicy pout. But yes, you guys, this is it. This is like a daily glam soft glam. I don't know what to call it yet, but definitely anime. I love the lashes talaga. And I just love how my skin looks so airbrushed. This is more of a trendy makeup, but somehow it looks flattering. Like, I love it. I got so many compliments when I wore it. And I can see doing this makeup look all the time. And yeah, I hope you guys recreate this. I'm gonna list all of the products I use, especially all the Baron Bliss products, these lashes that you need in your life, and all of the other links. I'm gonna link them below. Don't forget to please give this video a thumbs up and also comment below ano pang gusto yung mahitang makeup looks for me. Also, don't forget Marantan giveaway, okay? Just check the description box. I'll be giving away a bunch of Baron Bliss products. That is it for today's video. I love you guys so much. Thank you for always supporting me. I haven't done a makeup tutorial in a while and I just, I missed it so much. You guys are doing great. I love you guys so much and I'll see you on the next one. Mwah.